Hello, Your Royal Majesty. Welcome now to Thursday. And as always, thank you so much for watching Soul Garden. Cloudy, spaced out, chance of some mind games today for the royalty. The moon is now in Libra, so emotions and intellect are side by side. So your emotions trigger your thoughts, your thoughts trigger your emotions. And that's exactly where all the spiritual work is for you these days. With Saturn in Libra, you're going to be clearing out all of your mind games and head trips in the next 18 months. And today, you will be triggered. Something will trigger you. So try to not react to it, but observe it. That's what I always say to my clients in a reading who are dealing with third house issues. You don't want to own the thought. You want to watch the thought like a movie. So today, the universe is going to trigger you and expose an area where you're emotionally attached to a certain type of thinking. So for instance, maybe when you check your bank account, you are emotionally attached to worrying about the next paycheck. Maybe when you talk to your boyfriend or girlfriend, you're emotionally attached to always worrying about them. Worry is a typical mind game. That's one of the mind games. Uh, beating ourselves up is a mind game too, the self-critic, the judge. But there's an emotional attachment to that too. It actually probably makes you feel comfortable to worry all day about your boyfriend or girlfriend uh, and, that, and that almost is like a weird, twisted way of emotionally worrying so that nothing happens. A lot of times we like cast inside out. We focus on everything we don't want to have happen instead of focusing on what we want to have happen. And we are emotionally attached to that pattern because it makes us feel at the end of the day, although we've worried all day long, we feel safe and comfortable like the baby in the pacifier. So there's something about your emotional intellectual connection today that needs to detach or you need to realize in the next 24. Zip in the sun, it's also about your self-esteem. We're in chapter two of Sun in Virgo. This month, as you know, the Leos are working on raising their prices, stepping into their soul capital. Today, Neptune is ruling the day. Neptune is the synergy energy. That means we're going to log into our higher self and be intuitive. Great day to get some answers on self-esteem. And I would not doubt that whatever your mind game issue is, it ties into you feeling valuable or not valuable. So you want to sever those ties as well. Also, it's Thursday. We've got Siddiqui Salter's Run to Get Everyone Therapist going live today. She's got another plant essence that's going to make you feel valuable. You can eat it. You can smoke it. You can put it on your body. Whatever it is she's doing, this plant is here to help you. And for Leos, the Virgo plants help you with soul capital. So don't miss Siddiqui. She's live everywhere, Soul Garden Streams. Okay, Leo, that's all I have for Thursday. Tomorrow, Jupiter and Uranus reunite in Pisces. Intimacy around the corner for the Leos. All that and more in 24. Live, love, be. Soul Garden. Yeah.